but this is lung tissue. Feel it. It's kind of spongy. This is not your typical middle school science class. So let's look at some human aortas. And it's clearly making quite an impression on these kids. It's like really interesting because I've never really touched anything like that. Which is exactly the point. You can't do anything better than this to help students really understand what they're learning in school. What is a stem cell exactly? This is Science and Medicine Day, a hands-on biology lesson that gives 7th and 8th graders a fascinating peek into the human body and how it works. Let's look at lungs. Scientists from the UW Medicine Institute for Stem Cell and Regenerative Medicine lead students through several different stations in the classroom, examining organs. They're kind of spongy, right? Isolating the DNA of a strawberry. It looks like a slime. And using a cell phone app to peer at microscopic cells. The kids are what it's really all about. Dr. Charles Murray has been visiting this middle school for several years now. His message is simple and powerful. Science is the kind of thing that uh, anyone can do if they put their minds to it. And it doesn't matter so much where you come from. A message that resonates at this middle school, which teachers say is one of the most diverse in the country. I think it's pretty cool, just like how the scientists come and like teach us a lot of these things. Yeah, and like it just gives me an idea like what I want to do in the future since I don't know yet. Your heart's normally the size of your fist, right? A hands-on lesson that's making a powerful impact and perhaps a lasting one. That was weird. From the UW Medicine Newsroom in Seattle.